Hello guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video, it is a jeans haul. So I'm gonna show you all my favorite pair of jeans that I'm wearing at the moment in rotation. And when I find a pair of jeans that I love, I am very loyal and I tend to buy different colors because I find that it is so hard, especially to find online very good fitting jeans and also it is so important like I think a pair of jeans can look so flattering when it's a good fit but at the same time it can look even if it's a good pair of jeans but then it's the wrong size for example and it doesn't fit well I think it just looks wrong so I thought with this video I can maybe help you to shop online for jeans because I think it can be quite hard and I don't know about you but personally and I think especially after this year like I'm not a big fan of trying on things in the shop's fitting room at the moment here you can book an appointment to go shopping and then you have like a 20 minute slot and then you can actually shop in store I do love, of course, to go shopping when it's like accessories, like handbags or shoes, something that I can easily try on in front of the mirror of the shop without taking off my clothes. But it, when it comes to clothes, I 99.9% .9 shop online. I like to try on in the comfort of my house. I don't like when I'm like all dressed and makeup done, go into a shop and like undress and try on in a small fitting room. Yeah, I always shop online. So I have here my six current favorite pair of jeans. They are all, all different price points. So we go from like high street, quite affordable to I do have like one pair of like premium. So yeah, all type of price points. I'm gonna try them on with different looks and I'm gonna talk you through them in terms of like pricing and fabric and fitting and uh, sizing and then show you the styling like an overview of all of them. So if this sounds like your type of video, keep on watching. So before I start, because I think it is an important information to share, I am 175 centimeter tall. So I think it is 5.8. It says 5.8.8, so almost 5.9. So maybe I am a little bit above average height on like I'm on the tall side so I think this is important because when I try on the jeans when you see the fitting bear in mind that I am quite tall and also when it comes to sizing because I always get asked what size I'm wearing like when it comes to jeans and trousers I'm thin but my hips are quite wide so I always have to kind of go up one size because otherwise like the jeans would like button up here, but then they wouldn't go through my hips. So normally I am a size 28 in almost all of them, but I'm gonna tell you the size on each pair. So I'm gonna start from my go-to, this very classic blue jeans. The color on the website is called Acid Blue, and you can see it is the classic denim color I would say there is not a lot of stretch in this they're like high-waisted and straight leg and they are to me like for you to understand it like is the most similar to a vintage Levi's 501 not a lot of stretch like fits really good on the leg the leg is straight and you see in the try on and then what I was just mentioning before because I fell in love so much with the blue wash and I thought that was like an excellent price point that I've ordered of the same model, the grey color and the cream as well. So let's go with the grey. When you see on the website it is two different grey shades, very similar to each other and the one that I went for it is the washed grey which is the little bit like lighter shade because I thought it was nicer for spring rather than like a dark gray and it is exactly the same style but in gray. Okay, so basically these are exactly the same jeans but in the gray color. 
The funny thing about this is that it is exactly the same pair of jeans, but in the grey one, the fit, it is a little bit different. As you can see, they are more tight and also a little bit more of a cropped leg, which I don't mind because I can show off my anklets and I do very like a cropped leg for the summer and I wanted to show you a bit of a different styling so this time I style this with the loafers and an oversized shirt but I can come closer to show you if I lift up the shirt and I think that a great jeans in the summer it is a very good option for example if you don't want to wear like black jeans or black trousers I think light grey it is a very good option you still have like a dark element in your outfit but it's not so harsh like black if you don't like to wear black in the summer I personally do but I know that some people prefer to wear lighter color in the spring summer and I style it with this oversized shirt and loafers and the price is 69 euros exactly the same as the blue ones and I'm also wearing a size 28. It could also be because I've been wearing the blue more so maybe they are a bit loose on my body because they like shaped to my body already while I already wore this like one or two times and uh, maybe they just need a little bit more wear in order to loosen up a bit. And uh, this again it is exactly the same color but in cream. It is called Ecru on the website and I must come closer because you can see that it's not white. When it comes to denim, I always prefer rather than like bright white, I might maybe wear those like in summertime, but for the all the rest of the year, I prefer when it's like a bit of like beigey sandy shade. You can see it's like a crew. It's not white. And funny enough, I find, and you'll see in the try-on, these are exactly the same style, same price, but I find that the sizing is a bit different, so the Ecru ones fits a bit looser, while the grey one is more fitted, which is perfect because when it comes to light denim, I don't like when they're like very tight and you see through the underwear. I think it's very unflattering, while I prefer when it's like a little bit of a more loose fitting that you can also wear with heels and it's just so much nicer, like much more flattering. And these are the third pair of the same, these are the cream color. I think I've styled it in the same way of the blue ones. First of all because I really like this styling, like simple but effective. And because I think like this you can see even better the similarities to the blue ones. I feel that the ecru color and the blue, they fit exactly the same, while the grey is a bit different. It is slightly shorter in the lunch. So if you're not as tall as me, maybe the grey length might be even better for you and uh, they are not so tight. You can see like I do have like still a lot of space at the back here and it's a very very high waisted, again straight leg, very very comfortable, like it's not very elasticated but it's not like a very tough denim so it's fits very comfortable on your body and I think like this is the perfect demonstration that there is nothing wrong in when you find something that fits you very well to get it in different colors because for me it is such a hard job to find a very good fitting pair of jeans that I was so happy to find a pair that fits so well on my body type that I'm not ashamed to have order like in all the colors because yeah, when you find something that fits you, like, why not having it in different shades? Because you know already, it's like a safe shop, you know already that fits you, so that's the best. Paper bag, paper jeans, for me these are the most comfortable thing, are my go-to jeans for those days that, you know, you want to be comfortable, you have to run errands, like you don't want to think of your outfit too much, but still you want to look put together. 
which is kind of always the vibe that I go for. The fit is like almost like joggers. They're like stretchy and they're like very, very comfortable. The whole waist is elasticated. I'm wearing a size 10 and the fit is quite generous. Like I must say that they're like almost a little bit big on me, but I don't mind a bit because they are so comfortable and when I go for like a casual look with sneakers, I don't mind that my jeans are a little bit loose, like almost like a boyfriend fit. And what I like with this is that when I want to make them a little bit more chic, because maybe you don't want to show the elastic or you want to add a detail, I like to wear them with a belt and then you know, you can show a little bit elastic but still showing it a bit because of the paper bag waist. I think it's nice to show it. And then you tuck in your little spring knit. And I think it looks very cute. The price is excellent. They are 34 pounds. You have five pockets. They come in two different colors. I only have it in this dark wash blue. But they also come in a washed out black, which is like a dark grey basically and they are both really nice. Uh, black skinny that I personally like to wear all year round. It's probably like more wintry because I would wear it a lot in the winter with like high boots and then I tuck them in but I also really like them with sandals like high heels and a shirt for example like with this styling and these are also from Oasis it is another really good price point they are 44 pounds so I think when you find very good denim comfortable and a good fitting for less than 50 pounds it's like a very good steal what I like about this is that they are skinny but they're not too skinny sometimes they almost look like those jeggings I don't like for example when they like almost looks like tights and uh, these are like skinny but with a bit of a straight leg. What I don't like in skinny jeans is when this part is very tight while this one falls straight and I think it is a much more flattering style. And for the price I think it's excellent, they are made of 98% organic cotton and then you have a very high waist and it's like quite sculptural around your waist so I think it is another great fit and I'm wearing size 10 so these ones they go in a different sizing type like not like the normal jeans but they're like trousers I think and this is my regular size size 10 like you know that in a lot of things I tend to size up, but not in a skinny jeans. I think a skinny jeans has to fit really well. So I went for a size 10, my regular size, and I must say that they are quite forgiving. So you don't need to size up in these ones. Last but not least are these Anin Bing jeans. These are more premium comparing to all the other ones that I showed you. They are a higher price point. They are 228 euros so definitely more expensive in terms of difference i must say that the denim does feel thicker but not in a more warm meaning i don't know if you can understand in terms of quality i think i really really love the acid wash i didn't have any jeans like this in my wardrobe and uh, yeah i loved it when i put this i did a reel with this on my instagram and i received so many dms so many people loved these jeans which i can understand they are like you know a slim fit very simple pair of jeans and i think the color is so perfect for the summer i like it just like this with a white t-shirt and sneakers i think this is very much like my go-to spring look like a white t-shirt or black jeans sneakers or sandals and a lot of jewelry <laughs> that is what i like to wear so simple but effective and then if this styling for you it is to dress down you can add a nice camel blazer that always does the job and yeah, I really like this. The only thing that I want to say about these jeans is that, in my opinion, they fit 
very tight. It's a size 28, so like the same of all the other jeans that I showed you, especially the first three, they're also size 28, but these are really tight. So I can bottom them up, but I wish that I went one size up. Also because the fitting, even if I really like it, but it looks different from the picture on the website. The picture on the website, it is more of a, like a loose fit, while these ones almost look like skinny jeans on me. So I think if you size up in these ones, it might be a good idea. Or it could also be that I only wore them once, so I still need to wear them a little bit more in order for them to give a bit. But yeah, it's definitely a tight fit. It's not a generous fit at all. <laughs> okay guys, this is it. These were my six favorite pair of jeans that I'm wearing on rotation at the moment. Apology for the really terrible lighting today. I feel that this crazy weather is really not on my side <laughs> But um, yeah, everything is gonna be linked down in the description box with all the sizes and the links and also the links to my outfits as well and uh, Thanks for watching. Please subscribe to my channel for more videos Give me a thumb up and feel free to ask me any questions in the comment box and I see you next Sunday with the next video. Bye!